Hello everybody! Today's video is about how to adjust the frequency of the RF output on a Japanese Famicom console in order to make it easy to use with a modern American television, specifically Roku TV. There is a great video that I watched that I will link in the description below here uh, that you will definitely want to watch to perform these tweaks and adjustments. In that video, he does a great job explaining how frequencies work for things like broadcast television and radio, and the fact that Japanese channels 1 and 2 that are on the back of the Famicom console actually overlap FM radio frequency here in the States. That said, he also let us know that channel 6 is the closest American channel that could be used. To do this adjustment, you'll need a different television that can be manually set to channel 6, and you'll need to take apart your Famicom. The basic idea is that the Famicom will be powered on and open as you make the adjustment and watch on the TV. So, take your Famicom, and you're gonna plug it into the other television with RF output, and leaving the power adapter connected and the unit flipped on. Now be careful, again, power is running through this thing. But look up here, the green cap there, as indicated in this other video, is the RF output frequency modulator. Now on the top of that, there's actually a little slot, looks like for a flathead screwdriver. I do not recommend using that, uh, use something ESD safe, because again, this unit is turned on and power is flowing through this. I don't want you to electrocute yourself, but Essentially, you will twist this clockwise and you will see the middle piece, the black piece there, will lower. The frequency will lower and as you continue turning it, you will begin to see the image appear on the television of whatever game you have plugged in. Now plug the Famicom into the Roku TV and turn it on with a game in it. Go to Settings, TV Inputs, Live TV, scan for channels, and find channels. This process may take a good 10 minutes. And there you have it. It found channel six, so now I can just go to Live TV, turn the Famicom on, and play my favorite games. Hope you enjoyed.